guys, this is Bennett from Fanatic Ray, just bringing you another vid. Um, this time we've got an all-in for you against Terran. Um, pretty much the only super early game all-in that's left, because Roach Bane is kind of out of fashion now. Since Hellion Banshee is pretty much the metagame and fast 3cc, so Hellion Banshee like takes a massive dump all over Roach Bane all-in. So that's not in popularity anymore, and there isn't really any good two base, like really early two base all-ins from Zergi against Terran. But this is one that's left that works for me. Um, so basically, first of all, you take a 15 hatch, and um, then you go for a 16 pull, so completely standard gasless opening. And um, the reason this is strong is because when they scout, they see gasless, and then as soon as their scout is out of the base, you take double gas. So whenever a Terran player sees gasless, like they just think, oh, I'm going to play super greedy, and yeah, they just I'm just gonna play super greedy, get three CC, go Hellion Banshee, you know maybe skimp on a bunker if if I want to. Um, so as soon as my Zerglings pop, I chase the SCV up, and you want to be taking the gas about 420, but sometimes the SCV will still be in there. So as soon as he goes out, then I take the gas. It ends up taking the gas about 430 and 435 for the other one. Um, and then this SCV just gets chased across the map. Then you just drone straight up to 28 supply. Um, you get your double queen, obviously, um, because you want to play standard. As soon as you get to 28 supply, drop a roach warren. Um, get guys in gas as fast as possible. Go, go, go. Yeah. And then when you hit 28 supply, you've got a roach warren. Um, just build triple overlord. And what you're going to do is just save up gas and then just build mass roach up until 52 supply. So I'm just going to speed the game up because nothing exciting really happens. Just building roaches up to 52 supply. And as soon as you hit 52 supply, um, I'd wait for about 8 roaches before you move out because they will, they won't all pop at the same time. They'll kind of just like string in. And you kind of need all of them at the same time, otherwise it's easier to defend for him. So as soon as you've got 8 roaches, move out. And then as soon as you get 52 supply and roaches, get double overlord, um, save up your gas and get speed. And as soon as you get speed, pull all your drones off gas. Um, I did leave one on each. Yeah, this time, but that was a little mistake. Moving across the map with the A-Roaches, um, you want to try and pick off the Hellions, because the Hellions are the thing that's going to make your Ling follow-up slow. But um, here we go, I'm coming into the base of the Roaches now. I actually get a really good position in this game, so if you can get a position like this, I really recommend it. I, I completely block all of his SCVs off on repair, and that's an absolutely sick position. Um, if he's repairing the bunk, you want to target the SCVs. But um, in this game, it goes pretty well for me, um, going into the main, trying to pick off Hellions where I can so my Lings are stronger. Lings are rallying across the map now, keep injecting and building more Lings. Uh, yeah, injects going good for me, Lings streaming across the map. Picking off that cloak because that can, can become annoying if they end up getting that up and you know, somehow holding. Um, but yeah, Lings coming into the base, it looks like I, pick, I picked off most of the Hellions. So my Lings are going to be really strong now. And this is pretty much just GG. And that's the Roach Ling all in, guys. Um, pretty much the only really early two base all in left. I hope you enjoy it. Hope you can get some nice, easy wins with it. Thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what um, race you want to see all in next week, so I'm releasing one of these all ins a week. And yeah, thanks for watching. Peace. Yes, there he was cracking, bro! Oh, no, we're